And wait, wait, I have to say this. Tomorrow, from noon to 5, Dom is everything half price. He told me to say 40, but it's half price. It's half price. That's for real. It's half price. Let's see that place. Yes, it it tomorrow. Okay. Uh, good luck, Dom. Call us if it gets out of control. Um, and last but not least, um, the makers of Tiger Blood. No. Yes. Tiger Yeah. Yeah, read it for me. Wait. You can't touch it. Oh, okay. You can't touch it. Wow. Touch it. Wow. <laughs> dare you. 100% organic. Yes. Tiger yes. blood. So let me just... Thank oh. you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, so is that uh, your uh, plasma? Uh, is that your plasma? They yes. think it is. Um, <laughs> by the company Ritual Cleanse. And Natty it's rewrote so their good, slogan. It's so you would uh, never know it's healthy. <laughs> yes, indeed. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> um, and of course, and of course, uh, everybody's wondering where... The other half to this, this this beautiful goddess union might be. She's um, she had to go take care of some business. We won't say where. Do we know where she went? Well, of course we do. Some little town in the middle of America. Some little town in the middle of America. Um, the rich. We love you. We miss you. Mwah, 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 mwah. Rachel. The Rachel. <laughs> awesome. So I think what um, what needs to be uh, discussed here is that. Um, Tonight is a is a is a bit of an experiment of sorts. We are going to uh, we're going to give you little snapshot views into uh, the, the 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 things that you're going to be seeing from week to week, from day to day, perhaps. That that all depends on um, how many of you show up and insist that we stay. <laughs> um, my monologue looks something like this. This has not been seen yet. I'm unveiling this for the first time <clears throat> on live. Computer vision. Ah, there it is. Can we see it? Do we see it? What is it? Can we see it? What is it? What do you think it is? A tattoo? Yes, it's it is. Winning. Yes, winning. Win no! Winning. What? Because guess what we're doing? <laughs> guess what we're doing all day? Every winning. second. Winning! Every day. Winning. 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 I've been talking winning. Winning. Everyone, everyone out there who thinks that they've been winning along with us, who's been supporting this entire movement, that is in fact winning. I want you to go to your window. I want you to open it, because if you don't, then no one can hear you. Um, and I want you to join our chant. Winning. 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 Kind of ended a little bit. I've been tying lately. Is that yeah. a problem? Um, yeah, it is a problem. Yeah, tying. Okay, we'll get is, me. Tying is losing. Okay. <laughs> yes. Well, no, but it's also with technical. Okay, we'll get you. Yeah. yeah. I got you, <laughs> Somebody educate him. Um, <laughs> so right so now I'm, I'm, on, I'm on Twitter, and we just got uh, Johnny O just said winning, watching and winning. Did he scream out his window? Um, I'll get back to you on this. Out people. your window, Johnny O. Type it back Go to your window. Johnny O. Johnny O. Open it. Johnny O. Open your window. I think I'm gonna drink a little bit of me. His window. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you're here, my That's man. That's why I'm here. That's why you're That's here. Why I'm here. Yeah. Winning. Winning. Um, so that brings us um, to another uh, portion of our show that will um, resist. I think, I'm sorry. See the cats. I, I can see nothing. <laughs> the cats were unbelievable. We're going cats to winning this. against dogs. Yes, of course. Should yeah. we show that to him? <laughs> But these aren't winning images. I don't know what, what it is. Do you cat cat sound? Yeah, uh, yeah. I need to do a car crash. Okay. <laughs> good. 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 Or a fart. <laughs> Promise we'll have more sound effects soon, right? Yeah, oh yeah, no, yes. next up it's yeah. gonna be a very much okay, okay, good. I'm gonna be good. winning next time with this. Good, sound good, good. Excellent. Uh, and then uh, of course where a lot of shows would take you um, to the uh, to the bad news. Uh, we're not going to just go to the good news. We're going to go to the winning news. What other kind of news is there? Hello, duh. Kick us off, Rick. What do we got? What do we got in winning news? We have the Eagle Scout. Yes. Oh, that's right. We have um, uh, Zachary Alheim, who is the youngest Eagle Scout in his troop's 65-year history. Clearly. A winner. Winning. Yes, winning. Way to go, Zachary. Uh, we all here salute you and welcome you aboard the uh, the winning team. Way to go, Zach. Yeah, Zach. Yeah. 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 Yeah
Next we have, uh, apropos, the bald eagle. Yeah, now this is a story that I kind of questioned, um, although there is a, um, an absolute win involved in this story. Um, but tell me, am I, am, I, am I reading this wrong? Somebody read it. Uh, <laughs> a bald eagle crashed into a windshield and has recovered. Uh, Weagle, Weagle the eagle is now flying again, but probably not uh, rolling with his posse because they renamed him Weagle. Still a win, still right. winning. Still so winning. But um, yeah, in fact, if we we'll we'll, we'll take some votes, we'll take some online uh, name mm. submissions because Weagle the Eagle. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, regardless of all of his uh, street cred that he has now, um, I just don't see that that's um, that supports his winning ways. Reef haircut burger. Um, he said I'm in a state of denial, and so. Um, yeah, you're right, dude. You're, I'm in such a state of denial that I deny that you exist. <laughs> <laughs> you're gone. You're gone. Anyway, never speak of you again. Anywhere. Burr. Um, and here's where we go to the softer side of this whole little segment here. We uh, kind of wish I were them for 10 minutes, which is a lot for a mad genius warlock like myself. Winner. Duh. Um, Colin Farrell. Charles. Charles Burger. We're not there yet. <laughs> We're just not there yet. Trust me on this. Let me just finish. There's only three names. Okay, go. Dude, we're like seven seconds away. Um, Colin Farrell, again, I give you two mentions because you're just as, uh, as groovy as they get because, yeah, I want to be you for ten minutes. We'll figure out where am I and all that blah, blah, blah. Um, uh, Brian Feared Beard Wilson. Don't even speak. Let me just say his name again. And everyone just bow your head for a second. Brian Fear the Beard Wilson. He's going to break the record this year. Why are you speaking? He's going to break the record. Well, duh. Just for a second. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're back. Um, you to and, to and, the record now? Well, yeah, but you're stating the obvious. You're stating the obvious. And the man, the man delivers uh, 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 fury, vengeance, hatred, absolute world domination. Um, as, as, as I like to say, uh, in his underwear before his first cup of coffee, you know, he's just, uh, he's just better than you. I don't care who you are. Um, and and um, all, all BSing aside, we can't really swear here, can we? Yep. We can't, right? Yes. We don't want to lose, like, you know, sensitive sponsors. No, no, or do we? Um, all bullshit is that. Um, uh, Sean Penn. Sean Penn. And I guess I only want to be in you for the 10 minutes when just the fists were making contact with those loser faces. Boom. Crush. Good night. Loser. Winning. Duh. So. I think Sean Penn's going to break the record. I think he is. Yes. Yeah, yeah it's going to come down to him and Wilson. Final game <laughs> of the season. Um, and then, you know, sort of attached to uh, Kind of Wish I Were Them for 10 minutes um, is um, a thing we uh, had, had, had originally um, decided it would be called... Um, yeah, just because they're bitching, right? Which I think went in a in a much better direction. Um, that these uh, these fine gentlemen, and trust me, different people will find themselves on this list from week to week, or again, up to you, night to night. Um, and it's a uh, it's a little <laughs> no, it's no. A, it's spending a, too much I'm spending too much money. <laughs> what have we spent so far? Hold on, where's my calculator? Hold on, man. Oh gosh, none of it makes sense. Upside down. Hang on to this. Put batteries in that. So. Um, I like to call this list the um, the Gnarls Gnarlington list. Gnarlington. Everyone say it. Everyone say Gnarls Gnarlington. Gnarls Gnarlington. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. no. We're past that. Okay, we're past that. Okay. I get cool. into that one. <laughs> oh, and let's uh, let's spend a little money on some air conditioning, maybe. Um, wow, what happened there? Winning. So, um, <laughs> the top of our uh, Gnarls Gnarlington list, Reginald Martinez Jackson. Who is of course otherwise known as Mr. October, Reggie and Jackson. Gnarls. Yeah. Yes. Gnarls. Um we're also gonna we're also gonna GG our way to Todd Zeal. Gnarls. Absolute Gnarls. Gnarls. Gnarly. And um somebody talked to him afterwards. Um, <laughs> and of course my dear friend, and if they ever like make this movie, um, the new uh, face of William H. Hayes, uh, Mr. Tony Todd. <laughs> Gnarly. 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 
And, uh, well, here's kind of a big name that I can, like, uh, after I say it, I just gotta go like that, but then where others put it in the drawer, I just, I mean, eat it. Um, Mark Cuban. Gnarls! Gnarly! And then, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. There's, there's another, there's another, there's one more, there it is. Who's, who's this guy? Me. <laughs> Bye, Gnarls! Gnarly! Uber Gnarls! Gnarlington! You got it. You could have come in on that one. No, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. I got so many Charlie of these quotes they want you to say. Okay, well, we'll do them. We'll find, we'll, find, we'll find a spot for them. I mean, here's because I can, never, I can never speak the truth enough to my people. I can never speak the truth <laughs> enough to my people. Can we spend a little money on air conditioning? Are we like, over our budget, can Brad? We, can we open a window? We don't want this, we don't want this <laughs> secret <laughs> chamber of sound to escape out into the normalcy of a human bill. Who knows what will happen? Let's see how this thing developed. We already do this? Yeah. No, it's done. Let's um Leo, Leo Barno, where are you at? Here. Let's get this in the mail tonight. I know tomorrow's Sunday, but let's get the jump on this for <laughs> Josie and Nipples. Yes, Thank you. Right on. Um okay, again, again experimental, but I'm sorry, this thing is going pretty damn good. It feels great. Me. It feels great back here. Feels yeah, like wow. Winning. Wow. Yeah, it feels <laughs> like winning. Winning. I just feel like winning. We're gonna get to those in one second. Let's um, the little thing I rolled out uh, the other night. And I think you're all gonna be familiar with the term fastball. I, I was I was prefacing it with all right, globe. No, it was all right, country. Then I went all right, globe. Here's another fastball for all of you. Now it's just fastball. So that's our cue. When you hear fastball, you know that like that 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 the warlock, that the that the machine is about to roll out some gold. It's about to like educate you, your children, and like all those little diaper wearers down the road. So, um, one of the things we, um, we, I, duh, rolled out, um, <laughs> that I little thing called plan better. I think I said where an excuse uh, often sits, uh, this is a perfect replacement. So, I'm going to bring in the great and perfect uh, Natty Napalm. <laughs> Hi, world. <laughs> but I've been a good turkey this year. <laughs> Sorry, hardcore George Scott. Um, where's your... See, right there. It's right here where I belong. A little thing called plan better. So yesterday I uh, tripped over my dress and I fell up the stairs. <laughs> plan, better. plan better. Plan better. This one goes out to the dudes for those times you get your scrotum stuck in a zipper. Plan, yeah. plan better. better. And about a few months ago I woke up and I was blonde. Plan, plan better. <laughs> I loved it, but okay, plan better. Thank plan you. better. Yeah, no, you're welcome. You're awesome. So, not a napalm. Yes, yes. This is not Everyone really is asking who your favorite interview was over the last week or ten days. I don't know if you want to answer that. Wow, wow, which drubbing was the least painful? No, 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 no. Well, yes. No, Rossin, the Jeff of Rossin was an absolute, is an absolute rock star. Um, I mean, he'll never have this cover or look like that, but, but, um, I should sign this and send it to him, right? Okay. To Jeff, with love, me. Um, <laughs> no, but no, he, um, he was the one that, that, that I felt really, um, kind of drove the story in a way. Now, I know there's a couple times where his, his, like, borderline, not borderline, complete and total idiotic producers, like, got in there and, um, did things while he was asleep under the cover of darkness and, and that stuff he can't control, but, but his voiceovers were not as biting. They were very supportive. I thought there was very, he had some insightful yeah. stuff going on. Jeff you know? was great. Jeff was great. He was great. was great. He was great also behind the cameras when he was just here hanging out and in between the stories. He was a good guy. I really liked him. And now tell, tell, tell me what he told you when um, it was revealed because at one time he wanted to come in and shoot all the, all, all the B roll, which is, uh, which is behind the scenes footage that you get that they'll, that they'll fill uh, the visual uh, portion that they'll do voiceover over for most of these these news stories, these journalist news stories. What did he tell you that when I said no more camera crews in the house? Not just not 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 because I me, mean, the homeowners association had shut it down. Right. They shut it down. They said no more crews here. Um, if she wants to burn down the world, he's not going to do it in Mobile on the states. So uh, now these morons. I'm sorry. They sent me a letter like threatening me, like too many cameras, too many people, too many this. I'm like, hmm. what cameras? I don't know. I don't say anything. Yeah, but there's cameras here now. I'm dying to see. But we're not going to tell them that. I'm not going to say I'm Lord. So, um, so, so, history tab, bring me back. 
Um, homeowner association. Thank you. Thank you. This horrible letter. And it said like, um, you're, you're, you're mean to the guards. You're mean to all the guards. I'm like, no, the guards are stupid. And they, um, they have one job to do. They have one, no, they have one job to do. Do it once, do it right. You sit in a box up there with a list of names. People roll up. You know who the residents are. You know who's living here. You know that, that in an international, on the international stage, she's referred to as a goddess. She doesn't stop and get a, and get a measly uh, a pass from your little box. And I, and, I, and, I, and I called the guy and said, dude, if this happens again, then you've got to go find another job because it's, it's completely unacceptable. If it took me that many takes to get something right, two and a half men would have been off the air years ago. So, yeah, Jeff Rawson. Yes, back Jeff to Rawson. Yes. Back to Jeff Rawson. Jeff is probably going to be watching going, what, what, what? Let me just say this. About me. Let me just, about guard. And then what, what about Howard Stern? Stern? They're all saying, Charlie. I love Howard. He's a spawn seven. I love Howard. I love Howard. But hold on, before we get Howard Stern. Nasty Francis. These people let two of my cars get driven out that front gate. And they're going to complain to me about cameras? I, cameras? You talking about cameras? <laughs> I, can <laughs> relate, I can relate because I'm a flaming homeowner. So, uh, wow. Crickets, wow, crickets. we just lost all our sponsors. <laughs> There's the crickets. Um, so you're going to finish up with Jeff. We're awesome. Yeah, well, we're done with him. I mean, he was, um, was going to come in for an interview, but his bosses said, unless you can film it, um, you can't be interviewed. And I had, some, I had some tough questions for him. What I thought would be funny is if I take you know, one of these, one of these, these this gentleman, if I take this gentleman uh, and this, this media personality and sort of turn the tables on you know, and like lean in really close, and the good lighting on me and the bad lighting on him, and say, you know, uh, you know. Uh, so, Jeff, what was that? Uh, what was the what was the foam on that first beer like? And just wait. And in the promo, he like he blinks and looks down because he's shamed by his actions. So, Jeff, talk to me about that first Advil. Was it the Advil that led to the Aleve? And after after your first bottle of Aleve, over the course of Jesus, what was it? nor did it ever exist. Um, I have here what I kind of like to call the Apocalypse Now channel, and um, people might think it's a DVD, not. Uh, it's just streaming Apocalypse Now all day long. Where does, <laughs> where does DirecTV stop? Because my DirecTV has one extra channel, the Apocalypse Now channel. Jealous face. See there? That's my jealous face, by the yes, way. Yes, yes. Okay, <laughs> so somebody handed me a... Uh, you know, a decent, a decent little piece of literature here from a film that like, feels like a thousand centuries ago. Um, I think I'm doing this in the mirror. Maybe I didn't have a hat on or looked a lot younger. Scary was, Movie 3? No. no <laughs> sorry, no promo for you, young man. Um, where I'm looking at the mirror, I say, uh, life, life all comes down to a few moments, and this is one of them. Anyone? Anyone? Wall Street. Oh, yeah. Wow. I was just about to say that. Yeah. Mark Platoon. Yeah. How about that seat roll? Yikes. <laughs> Okay, She's so, never seen oh. it. Sorry, I just called her out. <laughs> hasn't wow. seen it. Looks wow. like we're watching the movie later. Wow. It's hard for her to watch it, by the way. Sounds like a date. Oh, oh, let's get it to the quote. You know the poem? Okay, this, uh... No, the quotes. You got a couple quotes. Oh, I only got this one here. No, you got to get this one because this one's definitely one of my favorites. Oh, this is, yeah, this is such an epic, epic t-shirt and everything else. This is like tattoos and babies' names in the future. Um, I'm not bipolar. I'm by winning. winning. Yeah, my favorite. Winning. Gnarly, gnarly. Gnarls. 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 Okay, um, I want to read a thing called, I can just find it. Want me to put a fart between? No. <laughs> yeah. yeah? Always. <laughs> it's a little thing called, um, can you see that? It's called the big white phone. It's just about everything just kind of melting down around you. Imagine that. Was that um, a picture of the toilet? Uh, yeah, but it's got okay, a so No, man. Oh, no, okay. <laughs> I thought it was put, it's time a, exactly. Sorry, I'll figure it out. Uh, before I do that, um, I am tired of pretending I am not a total bitchin' rock star from Mars. Okay, all right. You want me to read the poem, Brad? Yes. Okay. Everybody pay attention. It's important. It's called The Big White Phone. In the twisted times of a running game where floodwaters raised coffins from pain, where the worms of freedom have all gone insane, I pluck them or suck them from the heart of my brain. When the edge of confusion appears in disarray, it's an act of illusion, dead babies would say. 
When the clock's final ticking exposes your day, it's your balls will be clipping in the dock of your bay. When leaders ring true in the eye of the mass, their blood turns cold blue while the dogs eat the grass. Their painful decay shoves a snake up your ass. The act of delay they promise will pass. Until we find through true release the volume of our moans, they pack our bags with sullen peace while their children sleep alone. When these acts of truth arrive in time, please read them high in tone. I'll be heaving bile in a vicious style as I talk to the big white phone. Love it. Very beautiful. Love it. Crowd loves it. You get a clap from the chat room. Right on. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank yep. you. Right on. Right on. So I guess, uh, I guess unless my producer has anything else he wants me to plug, um, <laughs> I guess uh, that sort of wraps up this. Uh, yeah. Big uh, first. Big first. Hold on. Hold on. There was oh. something that. Uh, uh, so I want to thank you all. Thank everybody you. In the room as well. Everybody out there. I want to thank you all for uh, for joining us in this 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 maiden uh, madcap. Um, Experiment officially known uh, from this day forward as Sheen's Corner. And here's how we're going to go out every night. Psst, check it. <laughs>